Yesterday, I covered when the anniversary itself should be starting for Global Dokkan, but today, we're covering when the banner should actually release. And yes, the banner time, or the banner release time, is always different than the actual start time of the anniversary, and there is reason to believe that it's going to start even earlier this year compared to previous years, and I'm going to explain all of that right now in today's really quick anniversary video, but I need to tell you right now, since... We were talking about the eighth year anniversary, all the next, the, the next few subscriber challenges or, you know, push up challenges. If you are already subscribed, of course, will be eighth year anniversary related. And today specifically, if you have less than 88 dragon stones in your account, I don't know what the heck you're summoning on. You got caught lacking today. You got to subscribe to the channel. It is what it is, but at least you're keeping up to date with all eighth year anniversary info for me. Cause we are covering absolutely everything. And of course, if you are already subscribed, then drop down and give me five push-ups if you're below 88 stones. There's no reason why you should be below 88 dragon stones. However, if you have exactly 88 or more, then you can skip today's subscriber challenge or push-up challenge if you're already subscribed. Thank you for having more than 88. I will try and catch you lagging in the next one, though. Stay tuned for that, especially when I test your RNG for those summons. Let's actually hop into the video. So the first thing I need you to understand, that way everything in this video makes sense is that over the course of the last few anniversaries sorry about that sound the anniversary banners have been releasing slowly but surely sooner and sooner every single year so to go all the way back during the fourth year anniversary the anniversary itself by the way this is the exact start time for every global anniversary okay the 6th of july at 16 pst i'm telling you it's usually this is the 6th or the 7th depending on where you live right but essentially it's the 6th of july the 7th of july at this time but it starts every it's the same every single year so that was the fourth anniversary the fifth year anniversary is the exact same the sixth year anniversary was the exact same the seventh year anniversary was literally the exact same and you can expect the eighth year anniversary to start at the exact same time okay cool however the banner times have been slowly getting sooner or have been slowly releasing a little bit faster so during the fourth year anniversary the banners dropped on the eighth at 2159 pst okay during the fifth and sixth year banners they drop at the same time at 15.59 PST, so almost six hours earlier, right, than the fourth year anniversary. And then the seventh year anniversary banners here, um, what was it? Yeah, they dropped at 21.59 PST, but on the seventh, not the eighth. So this is in fact sooner than all previous years. And again, there's reason to believe that it's going to be even sooner this year because over on JP Dokkan, they dropped it even sooner as well. So just to prove it to you, okay, the eighth year anniversary for JP Dokkan started on the 28th of January at 19 UTC, okay? Just for some context, 19 UTC, is equivalent to 7 p.m. And just for those of you that don't do military time, and for me, that is 2 p.m. So 2 p.m. on the 28th um, is when the anniversary actually started over there in Japan. The banner release time happened on the 29th at 11.18 UTC. So again, more context, 11.18 um, UTC is 11.18 a.m., which corresponds to or translates to 6.18 6, uh, 6 a.m., again on the 29th so the difference between the start time of the anniversary and the release of the banners is 16 hours and 18 minutes 16 hours and 18 minutes that is way faster than last year where last year for jp the anniversary began at four o'clock in the morning jst time on the 29th and the banner released at 1.40 in the afternoon, JST time on the 30th, so more than 24 hours right after the start of the anniversary. So if we go by how quick the anniversary uh, released this year, or the banners released this year for JP, 16 hours and 18 minutes after Global Dokkan's usual, yeah, usual anniversary start time, which again is right here, will bring us to, uh, but just uh, let me actually translate this for you. So 16 is usually 4 p.m., and uh, that is usually 7 p.m. EST my time. So 16 hours 
and 18 minutes after 7 p.m. for me is usually around 11.18 p.m. on the 7th, which means the banners will be dropping a lot faster than every single previous year. Now, I know not every single person lives on the East Coast, which is why I usually have all of these videos right here. Look at this, exact, hold on, hold on, exact, let me, let me do every time zone. I drop a lot of videos on my channel about when things drop in every single time zone because I know not everyone lives on my time zone. So I'm telling you, when I tell you I got you covered for everything 8th year anniversary related, I'm telling you right now, I got you covered for everything 8th year anniversary related, including everything, Ex including everything. I'm making sure I'm keeping everyone up to date. I don't care where you live, I got you covered. So I will also keep you up to date for the exact time that the eighth year anniversary banners drop and of course every single time zone so stay tuned for that however it's going to be for east coast around 11 18 p.m now of course that is based off of jp's time global like i showed you before have been releasing their banner sooner and sooner every single year so there's reason to believe that they're going to follow jp schedule if they don't follow jp schedule i still expect it to release around sometime you know the seventh i would say around the seventh um on some hour some weird you know obscure hour on the seventh but if not it could still release on the eighth or maybe they could just say f it and release it a few hours after the actual start of the you know the anniversary login bonus and missions and stuff like that either way either way i'm going to let you know via that exact or every time zone video the reason why i'm making this video is to answer all of those questions um, that people have been leaving in the comments or in discord specifically about when does the banner time you know the banner actually release because like i mentioned before the banner time is not going to release the same time as the anniversary itself there's always a discrepancy in time and it's been getting shorter every single year so based off jp we can expect the banners around 11 18 p.m on the 7th for my time i will translate that for you when the anniversary actually comes um, but if not we can probably expect it a little bit sooner maybe a little bit later regardless i'm going to keep you updated so of course stay tuned for that and uh, it's going to be super 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 exciting there's no longer we're not going to have to wait two days anymore right because usually we would have to wait two days for the anniversary or you know a day and a half for the anniversary but it's going to be dropping sooner for sure and uh the stream that we're going to do for that is going to be insane we're going to have a lot of luck flowing in and out of that stream so hopefully you're there i'll see you in the next one take care eighth anniversary is coming and uh i hope that you can prepare with me i'll see you in the next one take care and peace